All right, third graders, we are on unit three, and this is reading, and we are focusing on the sequence of events in text and signal language for a sequence of events, like first, next, then, after, okay? All those words tell us when something happens, and sequence is in order. When we sequence events, we tell them in order. We can also determine the important information in a text. All right, so <clears throat> here's a sequence of events. Every morning before I come to school, I follow the same routine. First I get up, next I brush my teeth, then I get dressed and make my breakfast. Then I help my youngest two daughters get ready in the car. The last thing I do before I leave my house is say goodbye to my husband and my oldest daughter. What things do you do every day before you come to school? Try to think of them in order. All right, so you're trying to describe things in order, the way they happened. Good writers do this. They do this because it makes sense for us. So let's just look at some pictures. We're going to sequence these pictures and explain our reasoning. Hmm. First, what happens has to happen first when I look at these pictures? Well, first, it has to snow. And we have to get a lot of snow on the ground. And once we have a lot of snow on the ground, next, we will be able to make three spheres by rolling them in the snow to get them bigger and bigger. One sphere has to be big, a medium, and a small. After I have successfully rolled three spheres, I am going to stack them from largest to smallest to make a body. Lastly, I will add a hat, a carrot nose, some coal, a scarf, and other accessories to build a snowman. Do you see how we can sequence those events just based on the picture? Let's try this one. Hmm, look at these pictures. What has to happen first? Well, first, the eggs have to be laid. These are slimy frog eggs. After the eggs hatch, they are a tadpole. As the tadpole grows and is growing its lungs, it starts to lose, get, lose its tail, starts to develop its lungs, and lastly, it turns into an adult frog who can breathe out of water. All right, last one to practice with pictures. What has to happen first? Well, first, the apples have to grow on the tree, which takes a long time. Next, we would gather up the apples and bring them home to our house. Then we would have to cut the apples, Get them all prepared, follow the directions on a recipe, and make an apple pie that wins a contest, it looks like here. Now, what does sequencing look like in a text? Okay, let's look at this text. Yesterday, my class went on a field trip to the zoo. We went to see the monkey cages first. Then, there's another sequence word, we watched an elephant eating its lunch. After that, another sequencing word, we ate our lunches in the picnic area. After lunch, we saw the giraffes and the lions. At the end of the day, we stopped to look at the bears and on our way back to the bus. What did the class see right before they ate lunch? Well, first what I'm gonna do Oops, I'm sorry, I meant to get my highlighter. I'm going to find what they did for lunch. So it says, what did the class see right before they ate lunch? All right, here is where it says we ate our own lunches. So I'm going to look before that. What did they do before that? Well, before that, they watched an elephant eating its lunch. So we find the clues in the text and go to our answer. Look at here, I went and I referred to the text. Now, when we're talking about sequencing, <clears throat> we are also talking about ingredients and making things. So following a recipe, you have to follow the recipe in order to make a successful end product. So here 
you're gathering the ingredients. You gather your spoon and pan, you flatten the dough, you spread the sauce, you sprinkle the cheese, and then you bake, all right? So all of those things are gonna help us be successful. So we should be able to sequence all sorts of things. All right, let's do one more for practice. All right, how do we get milk? At a dairy farm, cows are milked using a machine and the milk is stored in containers. Then it's shipped in a refrigerated trucks to a processing plant. The milk is heated to kill the bacteria and keep it from smoiling. Finally, it's packaged and shipped to stores. What happens just before the milk is heated? Okay, let's find where the milk is heated. The milk is heated, okay? What happens before that? It is shipped in refrigerated trucks to processing plants. So what letter is that? Yes, A. Do you see how we can go back to a text to verify our answer? That is what you are going to do in your next activity is you are going to be practicing sequencing. I hope you are on target and you can figure out the sequence of a text.